Welcome back to episode 4 of Battlefield Hardline. Let's play. This is Steve with Tango Mike Gaming. Let me go ahead and get started here. Previously on Hardline, planes go up, drugs come down. Whose operation is this? Some ship bird named Remy Nelt. Nelt! Put the gun down! I took the deal. You, started, take it all. He was surrendering. Leave it alone, partner. Before evidence arrives. Yes, Your Honor. Well, I disagree with your basic assessment of the facts. No, I understand. Thank you for your time. That was the Honorable Naomi Kushner. And what do we think about Judge Kushner around these parts? Left-wing hack. Yes, the good judge won't give me a no-knock warrant for known associates of Nelts. That's just fine. War games, war rules. Mm. Captain Dawes, Mendoza. I... The three of us are a tribal council. And I'm very aware that we're having problems with one of the members of our tribe. He didn't take the money. <laughs> you were testing me. <laughs> well, we had to know if we could trust you. You know, from the very beginning, your partner assured me that we could. Now, you said that Nels was talking about a deal with Stoddard. Yeah, he sure did. Well, I need you to go back to Nels's office and get me something I can take to Internal Affairs. I realize that a hurricane's incoming, detectives. But this can't wait. Yes, sir. already been through here. What's the point? Well, they weren't looking for evidence against Stoddard. Look, we find anything, we go directly to Dawes. This goes to internal affairs. Dawes can't control what happens. You do trust Dawes, right? Stoddard going down doesn't look good for anyone. Now, Stoddard's dirty. You know it, I know it. I'll keep watch out here. You go inside, find the evidence we need to take him down. Gladly. Hey, I'm gonna look around the building, maybe poke through the trash. Good idea. Just stay in touch. Alrighty. You think Stoddard has friends inside the department? Probably. Dirty cops look out for each other. Let's hope they didn't pull any evidence. Wouldn't surprise me. If Stoddard was stupid, he'd be in jail. our evidence here.
Alright. 'Cause it wants me to go outside. Awesome. recently. something. I'm headed downstairs. Good. I'm down here now in the shipping container. Nelson Stoddard, on tape. Now when we go to IA, it's not our word against his. <coughs> Remy was storing his cash somewhere. I bet Stoddard's looking for it too. Look in there. What the hell is this? Some bullshit I don't pretend to understand. But I looked online and the only place that sells that crap is a store called Domo Roboto in the Popcorn Mall. He wouldn't be storing his cash there. Nope. That's why I got the warehouse's address. It's worth a drive-by. Through the front door. His daughter comes out without me. Assume the worst. I always do. Nick, I just got word from CP about a suspicious.
gonna follow it, okay? Yeah, all right. Just stay in contact. Lousy time for a hurricane, huh? Two buildings. Lots of guards. Remember what Dawes said, Medusa. Don't worry about reading these guys in the rights. This place looks locked up. Try the roof. Good idea. Backs down. Send the paddy wagon. Can't do 13. Stay alert. Freeze. Smoke him 
<coughs> All right. Ooh. When you find Stoddard, just let him talk. Hopefully, he'll say something incriminating. Guys, I don't care about your weed. Right? It's in two years. It's going to be legal anyway. What I want to know is which one of you moved Neltz's cash. He promised us that money, asshole. Yeah, okay. As of yesterday, I'm your new boss. Now, do you understand what that means? What would you say if you were working a case and some asshole shows up and tries to take the credit? I would say, let's talk about it. Huh? So, let's go do that. Shall we? He just took a few guys downstairs. Okay, follow him. Can't stay here on my house. Alright, that's good. Oh, dead. Dead. Let's try that again. We'll just do it this way.
You need to follow Stoddard downstairs. under arrest. Okay, you got it. A grow house. Oh boy. And there Stoddard. smoking them. Put your gun down. How about I just holster? Drop the goddamn gun, Nick. Let's just talk about it. Nick, I'm following those ship packs in the van. Negative. Do not engage them. Nick. Find out where they're going. Nick. What the hell was that? Nothing. Nothing to worry about. You can't arrest me. We're both dead. Come on, Mendoza. Time to get the hell out of here. You guys are torching Nelson's operation. Oh, really? I wonder why. <laughs> Come on, Stoddard. <laughs> You're gonna be in a burning building. This is the one to be in. Go now. Did you tell these guys to back off? 
Doesn't really work like that, Mendoza. <laughs> Get some more ammo just in case. Let's go get her! The Nelts usually had a few guys in the mall in case something went down. That plus the guys Kai was after. Plus whatever the hell else is going on. She's my partner! Oh yeah? Needs to be my job. I'm sure you would have done the same for me. Let's just go! Taking you in. Whatever you say. You should just arrest him right now. Kai's in that mall. And she needs our help. Come on. Any luck? Yeah, you weren't kidding about the manpower. Say what you will about Nels. He employed a lot of locals. So Nels has this Japanese toy store. I'm guessing he stashed some money there. Kai! Kai, I can hardly hear you! Whatever she said, it didn't sound good. Police! You're under arrest. Hey, man. 
I just work here, man. Police, you're under arrest. Okay, man. This is it. I finish this job, I take my spot. Better honor my time, even though Remy died. They will. They will. Police, freeze. Now. Okay, man. Thanks to you, we're off the books. You know, Nick, you really think I'm the only dirty cop in this town? Nope. But you're the only one I caught. And you still haven't arrested me. Pretty sure that makes you guilty of collusion. Yeah, just keep talking, Stoddard. Did you make out what? Get in the security room and look for Kai. Jolo Roboto! That's Nelson's store! It's got plenty of customers. Nelson's guys are coming. We might need him to get out of here. Uh, you hear that, Nick? 
As soon as we get out of here, we're taking you straight to IA. Let's just focus on the get out of here part first, okay? Oh shit! Sergeant Carl Stoddard, you have the right for once in your goddamn life to remain silent. Anything you say can and will be used against you in a court of law. That's enough. Everything you need to know is on here, Captain. Let me guess. You started the drug war. Encouraged one crew to wipe out another until none of them was left. None except his, sir. Hmm. I have a lot of evidence linking Nels to a rogue Miami detective, but it's all vague. <laughs> I had a lot of faith that you would find the last conclusive piece, and you did. Thank you. What the fuck? Hey, Nick. 
Let's really? See, you know. I really appreciate you saving my ass back there. It's above and beyond, man. Fuck you. Nick, don't. Kai. IA is gonna find a stack of cash back in your apartment. Thirty-three thousand dollars, in fact. The exact sum that Nels moved in his last transfer, so the question of course will be. What did you do with the rest of it, Detective? What the hell are you doing? Oh, guy went to bat for you. More than once. Why don't you just take the damn money? Is that what this is about? Nick, we tried! I was so certain that we would find a place for you with us. But no. You're convinced that you're just one of the good guys, aren't you? There's no such thing, son. <laughs> well, dang. A bunch of jerks. Well, thanks for hanging out with me during episode four. Uh, stay tuned for episode 5. If you have more questions about what Tango Mike Gaming is, feel free to check out our website at www.tangomikegaming.org. We'll see you next time. Next time on Hot Mike. Good evening, detectives. You probably have questions.